Hello mga artsy, this is Mrs. B. Welcome to Uma Arting Penmanship. In this video, I will teach you how to make letters from calligraphy basic strokes. So if you haven't watched my playlist about it, I will put a card on top for you. Okay, so somebody asked me, hey, I watch your videos, I know the basic drills, but how can I make letters from it? My handwriting is not good. Okay, so that is a question and I will answer that question in this video. So stay tuned. If you have your paper and pen with you, let's do calligraphy. For this tutorial, I will be using um, Pentel Fuge Touch in black. This is a small brush. Let's review quickly the basic strokes that we have. Okay, so we have the down strokes. Okay, there. And another one. We have also upstroke. Okay, make sure for upstrokes it is very very thin okay you could do um you could do it wherever you want to write it next we have overturn stroke all right and we have underturn stroke next we have compound curve Okay, next we have oval. We also have ascending loop. And descending loop. Okay, so these basic strokes, even if you do not have a good handwriting, you can still have a good calligraphy by using these strokes. Okay, so let's try for example a letter A. So let's calligraphy A. So we will have there an oval and you can have there an underturn stroke. There you go. You can add or you can actually cut, cut this in half, but most of the time for the letter A, you're going to combine it or place it together with other letters as well, especially if it's in the middle of the word. Okay, now let's try M. So for M, we do that as we write, but for calligraphy, you can... We have their... Um, well, you could have there an, an, an overturn and another overturn and a compound curve. There you go. So again, it's it, it is overturn plus another overturn plus a compound curve and there you have M okay let's try one more letter like G okay, so for G we have an oval and a descending loop there you go so we have G okay let's try to do letter D. Okay, for D we have an oval then their ascending loop. Okay. Again, for G it's an oval plus a descending loop. For D we have an oval plus an ascending loop there okay now let's try to do other letter like for example an H 
Okay, H here, we could write it in calligraphy like ascending loop plus a compound curve. So if we're going to write it in calligraphy, it would be ascending loop compound curve. There you go. Now let's try the letter Y. Okay, so for Y, we have, um, we could have there an underturn stroke and a descending loop. Or you could have a compound curve plus a descending loop. So whichever you like. Okay, let's try to do an S, a small S. So that would be an upstroke plus down, a curvy downstroke. So that would be up and there. Okay, now we could try to add a little style to our letters. Like for example, um, we will be doing and a small a so we could have a curvy crossbar like that then oval and compound curve okay like when we when we are going to combine it with other letters if we're going to write the word and okay so these would be connecting letters and that would be on another video all right so for example we have the we will write the word and we could write simply as oval and then and under turn stroke then we could have a down stroke there and a compound curve then you could have an oval for the D. And the last one is a semi glue. Okay, now you have an and. Okay, there. Simple, basic strokes so that we have, we can do it in calligraphy. Even if you do not have a pattern or if you do not have a good handwriting, you can still make calligraphy using the basic strokes that we have. Again, I will put the link for the basic strokes on the description box so you can easily see it. I hope this video helped you in doing calligraphy. If you like this video, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel so you can be updated on my latest videos. Remember that practice makes perfect and perfect makes permanent. So keep on practicing, keep on writing. Thank you for watching. Till next time.